Hey guys, Zulzin here, and welcome back to another episode of Slime Rancher. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. The jetpack is pretty good to get look, like a little bird's eye view of what's happening with the chickens. You ever notice that you always go in the chicken pen and you gotta count? It's not like they're dangerous or anything, but you can get an easy eyeball of what's going on with the chickens. I decided that I would put a silo here because of the amount of chickens I was getting, and sometimes I like to save up. The, the plort economy or plortonomics however they call them it gets a little ridiculous so if you start selling too much of one thing at one time it starts going down the market starts going down i've i've been finding that holding out and just waiting for a long time before you sell and just form 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 to get a lot of money and then stop and go do other stuff for a little while seems to be working pretty well we still got a lot of money so we're gonna get some unlocks today and I'm not gonna get, I don't have any specific goals for this episode, but I think I would like to get some more puddle plorts going. So this area is all filled up already. Uh, the front area is all filled up already. I'm still not sold on taking away my honey booms uh, because they do provide a lot of resources when I need them. Um, and my guys over here, the honey, Hunters? <laughs> Hunter honeys? Uh, they are just chilling right here, but I, I, like I said, I haven't fed them in a little while because mostly they take mint mangoes and I'd like to store up uh, some mint mangoes before I start feeding them anyway because they're, they're, a whole, they're part of the whole honey thing uh, and I don't want to get rid of it. I've got plenty of rad stuff going in. The only things I really don't have right now are puddles and pinks. And pinks are easy to get. Puddles are probably the hardest to get. Uh, and I don't have crystals either. I haven't found crystals either. Um, but I can get tabbies in the back that I already have. There's not, I don't get a whole lot of tabby plorts. But I suppose if I did need to breed something else, it would be pink tabbies, which are very common to tell you the truth. But rock is also a little uncommon. So we could do pink rocks. I think tabby rocks would be, I don't think I need tabby rocks. But I could do tabby rocks. Um, <laughs> but mainly, I need pink right now to build the drill. So let's go out and grab as many pink plorts as we can, just from the first couple areas. And I want to see how this works. Yes, I'm going to collect from these guys too. So I'm just going to grab the food that's already out here. So that I can kind of continue to feed these guys. It looks like there's a lot of pink slimes that aren't even out right now. We got... I don't need any phosphors, that's for sure. We have plenty of phosphors. There's not a whole lot that are out right now, but we can feed them. Will this guy eat? Yep. Give me a pink plort. Typically, they're all over the place. They're kind of chilling right now, huh? I wonder if this guy will eat. Yeah, he will. He ate a plort already. I guess we could pick up the phosphors. It's not going to hurt. Since we already are, like, in it or whatever. Get off of me. I'm trying... Get, what do you even, okay, maybe the, oh, there, I was about to say, where did the plort even go? All right, so we got a couple more pinks here, ah, uh, there we go. You guys eat, 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 eat. I just want your pinks. Give me your pink slips. And the, um, and the phosphors, I might as well collect the phosphors. Okay, eat, you missed, oh, maybe you didn't miss. Good, good, good. So these guys produce, it's a little bit, I mean, we do want to set up a pin for them. It's just proven right now. It's taken me a little while to get 20, and I really don't want to go through that mess. So yeah, we're definitely going to have to get some pinks here, you guys. So I'll tell you what, let's give this guy a pogo fruit, collect this last pink plort, and then we're going to suck up some pink slimes. 20 of them, to be precise, I think. And we can do some pink tabbies. We've got to mix pink with something. So I don't know... I don't know what the best thing to mix them with is. But we're, we got to mix them with something. So we may as well, right? Um, let's see here. And pinks eat anything too. So instead of having to worry about meat for a second set of tabbies. I think that'll be a good deal. I think it'll be a good deal. Where are all the pink guys? There they are. There's some. Alright. 
And I'm thinking instead of the, the carrots here, I'm going to go ahead and grab um, tappies too. I'm going to grab tappies. And we can set up... I don't know if I want to set up two pins of these guys. Give me the tabby. See, the tabby, the pink tabbies ain't that bad looking. They look like big bottles of Kitty Pepto Bismol. <laughs> that looks like, you know, the picture on the uh, the animal shampoo. That like, if you bought a bottle of shampoo to um, to wash your cat, that's exactly what would be on it. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to happen. Let me grab all of this mess here. It's okay. We're not really scared of Tories. They just make a mess. They really do. I have enough to start the process here. 35 plorts. We have 20 pinks already. So, yeah. So, we feed one of them a tabby plort. And it turns into a largo. Then we feed it some food. And it should be good. I could go to the next area, too. And I do need to grab some water here. Hold on. Let me grab some water. Also, I'm out of roostros at the house for some reason. I need to I need to put a few of them in the uh, the silo, just so I can always refill it. There we go, full up. Where's all the tabbies at, man? Probably in the next area, huh? Probably. Tabbies, get in my gun, tabby. My backpack. We might as well get the extra pinks too. We can always throw them off the cliff if we don't need any more. Oh, that's Tabby Plorts. I could do... I guess I can get rid of... I don't, I don't know what to grab anymore. I really don't. There's so much going on around me all the time over here at night. It's such a mess. I know, I could come in during the day, but... It's kind of, it's usually adventurous to come out at night a little bit. 48, 49. Uh-oh. Get off. Get off. I know, it's a mess. Okay, time to go. <laughs> it's getting a little ridiculous now. There's my 50. Okay. Uh, and phosphorus. I'll tell you what. Let me grab the tabbies, just because it'll be easier to, to make. Okay, that's enough. That's enough, I said. You want... You want some? Stupid. Get off me. Get off... They, what are you doing, burping? They might be burping. Tabby, tabby, good. Alright, we're full. So we should be good with this, okay. Let us head back. Not lettuce as in lettuce and tomato. Let us. Alright. I think we got... I mean, we could grab more pink slimes too. But I don't think... I don't, they're, they're not real volatile. So we might be able to shove a lot in a pin. We're going to have to kind of test it solo though. And I see a chest right there too. Also, I want to go get some... I want to unlock some treasure. I think we got the treasure cracker last episode. So that's going to be good stuff. There's treasure all around. And I haven't really explored... Like, I haven't really marked the locations in my mind. Not that I would do that anyway. Okay, so we have to unlock another area to put these guys anywhere. So let's do that. Right behind here, there's an entrance to another spot. Oh no, this is actually the spot I was thinking of. We need to go behind this one. And this is... I forgot what this is called. Overgrowth. That's what I thought it was. But Alright. Purchase. We are opened up. Still have 10000 to spend too. Plenty, plenty, plenty stuff. And we're going to get some drills before we're going to go out and explore. Don't y'all worry about that. Is there anything above here? Nope. Okay, good. Alright, this place looks cool. I know there's Roman chickens here, which is good. It'll be easy to feed pink slimes over here. I think... This would be a good area for puddles too, because everything's all situated in one spot, you know? And there's a teleporter. Where does the teleporter go? Have I unlocked this already? 
I sure have. It goes where the uh, the tabby um, Gordo was. Well, that's excellent. Good, good. Okay. Is there anything up here, by the way? Nope. But you can supervise. That's pretty good. All right. Let's go ahead and set this up. Pink. Coral. Coral. A uh, corral. Sorry. High walls. Music box. Air net. Floor collector. Auto feeder. Okay. And we're gonna set up pinks in here. Is that ten? That's. Dang it. I ain't even gonna try to count it twice. There's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Beautiful. Alright, we got 15 more to go. Let's set up. We can keep this one close by. We'll do pinks at the beginning here. Purchase. High walls. Music box. Air net. Plort collector. And auto feeder. The only reason I'm purchasing the music box is if I ever decide to breed something else. Um, the the solar shield is very situational, so I'm not really worried about that. All right. That's three, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. So there's not going to be any other kinds in here. I think we should be fine. There's no other types of slimes in here. So let's go ahead and load this one up. We're going to put 15 on the right. Okay. And let's do 14 on the left. All right. And let's feed these guys pink plorts. They need to turn into Largos. Okay, and now we're gonna have to get tabby plorts over here for these guys. And we're just gonna have to make sure we feed them. And there's chickens all around, so that should work out pretty easy. I've never loaded up pins like this, so it'd be interesting to see what happens. And honestly, if we do, if everything, if if everything just goes haywire, and all of a sudden uh, the Tories just start coming out, what are they gonna do? Like, eat pink tabbies? Seriously. It'll be a good experiment. Because I could just go back. Did I just say experiment like the gum flavor? Alright. So we got hens. Let's feed the... There we go. You should produce a couple tabby plorts. Eat that. Eat that. Eat that. Is there another hen? No, I think one ate it already. Okay. So those tabby plorts are going to double up. It'll be hard for me to keep track at this point. Let me feed some other ones over here. There you go. Pepto in the house! Alright, and they're going to produce a couple tabby plorts. Beautiful. I think... One just got eaten by a little slime. Yeah, that kind of sucks when that happens. All right. Also, yeah, before I put the before I put any of the puddles down here, I think that's what I'm gonna do because this might be a good place to get puddle plorts, or I might be able to do them in a in another location as well. What's up here? Is there anything up here? Should I even worry about this? Huh. This lets me get kind of like on top of the ranch. Where is this place? Oh, that's by the lab and stuff. Is that by the lab? No, that's a little bit different, huh? Am I... Where the heck am I? Like, I know where I'm at, but I don't know where I'm at. I wish I had like an overhead view. Of what was going on. We can go anywhere up here though? Wow, this is a um this is a pretty cool spot. So I wonder if we can make it over there. Let me let my stuff fill up. I can stay on top right here. A good little bit. Is there anything over here that I don't see? What is that over there? Okay, so 
These pink plorts, I need to deposit that in the lab. But they're only pink plorts. I really want to see what that is over there, y'all. Look at that right there. How do you get to that? Hold on, let's get as close as we can. I guess we can go, yeah. It's a little bit closer to get right here. Is that somewhere that I've already been a hundred times? I think it is. It seems like it would be easy to get to. What is this place? I got a couple heartbeats in here. I don't even know. Get out of here. Uh, get out of here. We don't need you in here. Okay, what's... I'm determined to find something different right here. Uh, a lot of fruit. I don't know if I need fruit. Um, okay. Oh, I can grab some roosters right here. Where the heck are we, though? <laughs> Look at this place, man. Seriously. Where is this? I have seriously never seen this before. I have no idea. <gasps> There's a treasure. Okay, let's grab this then. A more advanced treasure cracker is required. Oh, there's some feral rock slimes. Those look pretty cool. Alright, fair enough. Well, what's the easiest way? Let me go over here and see. Half up. Is this near the indigo quarry? Where the heck is this place? Where in the world are we? I have no idea. There's some cube berries right here. And there's like some little... Hmm. Okay. This is cool looking. Is this the indigo quarry area? This looks different, y'all. Hmm, <laughs> what well, this is a heck of an adventure. I've, I've really never seen this. I know I'm freaking out here, but like I've, I've explored quite a bit in Slime Rancher. Is this the Indigo Quarry area? It is the Indigo Quarry area. Well, that was a back door and a half. I mean, a back door and a half. Well, there's treasure here. What we got? What? What did it open? Minty grass patch? Though this grass does indeed have a pleasant mighty aroma, the taste is quite... What? So what exactly does this do? They're rolling around in it, whatever they're doing. They look happy right here. Hold on, did it tell me... Um... Resources... Slimepedia... Resources Ranch World. Okay, Slime Science Ranch Overgrowth. It doesn't say anything about Minty Grass Patch. Maybe it will start. Maybe something will grow right here sooner or later? I have no idea. All I know is I need to go make some drills before I get too carried away here. Alright, let's go back through here. Yes. Hello, my pretties. How are y'all doing? My little radical slimes. There's orca orcas everywhere. There's some to harvest, too. Let me pick these up right quick and deposit them in one of the feeders. Might as well. You know, I'm here. All right. Orca orcas. Let's just put 15 in here. Is some of them rotting right here? It's hard to tell. No, get back in there. Get back in there, crazy. Alright, very good. Very, very good. And we gotta stop by and add the Roostros. Pogo fruits. We can feed these guys. Yeah, they take fruit and meat. It's been a little while since we fed them, so I'll just use the extra Pogo fruits. And let's go to the lab now. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute. 
<laughs> it's it's crazy how much stuff I can collect here. I like the odd onions. When we get crystals, we're gonna be in business. I want the silo to be full of odd onions. Well, at least one shot, you know. Yeah, this is pretty. That's pretty darn good, man. All right, silo. working on it. It's a slow process, but it's filling up. Okay. Now it's drill time, y'all. It's drill time. Let's go get a bunch of resources and just deposit them around, and we'll pick up our leftovers that we had out already. So, we should have enough pink plorts to grab quite a few drills, which we haven't made any yet. Alrighty, there we go. Okay, so Novus Drills, Fabricate, 3, 4, 5, and Pink Plorts are going to be it. So, <laughs> I'm glad my pinks are going to be coming in here. Let's add the Roostro. We already have a Roostro here. We need a Roostro there, and we need to deposit a Roostro in here. Very good. That way, when we run out of Roostros altogether, when they get too old or whatever, we could just replace them, and that'll work out pretty well. Okay, and I got drills everywhere. Is there any areas in here? Yeah, there is. Let's go ahead and put one of the drills right here. All right. Uh, yeah, we're not going to do boat drills right here. Let's go out. And next time, we should have so much for the pinks, man. So much. I don't know if I want to get resources here. Okay. Hexacombs. We needed some of those. That was from an apiary out here, which is pretty good. Uh-oh. Guess we're not holding carrots right now. Deep brine. That's what I'm talking about. Alright. Beautiful. Let's see. Drill. Novus drill. Install. Very good. Um, alright, we got those. What's it do? <laughs> I like the way it drills, that's pretty cool. I like the way you drill. Alright, so we'll go to the next area. Which was... Through here. We got pink tabbies over here. This is not where I wanted to go, either. I always get confused. I take the first right instead of the second right. And I got confused again. <laughs> There's a little T that splits off right there. Okay, so we go through here and then we take the right once we're through. There we go. Alright. Anything in here that I can set? No. I didn't figure it would be in this cave, but there should be some like right when you get through. Okay, so now we yeah, this should be fine right here. This should be fine. Let's install a drill. I'll just install a bunch of drills right here. Beautiful. Now we got five uh, drills down, so we are we are good with that. That way we'll be able to check them and stuff. And uh, I suppose didn't I leave another resource somewhere around here? Tell you what, let me just make a quick pass. Oh no, that's where I came from, huh? It is. Also, I need to find the volcano. One day. One day I need to find the volcano. Ouch, man. Quit. Quit. Okay, where did I go last time? That was the drill that I just set down. Hmm. Is it back through here? No, that's that's the entrance way. Where in the world is the next area? 
I just got kind of sidetracked, I guess. Oh, through here. Okay, I was getting the caves mixed up. I'm not worried about no Tories. I don't want to lose these resources that I got, but we got a teleporter right here. Anything happen with this mint grass? Nope, not really. I'm not really sure what to make of that stuff, y'all. Not really sure what to make of it. Ouch, quit. I know you just want to kiss me, but it hurts. Alright. There's a lucky slime, too. What did... Oh, we don't have enough... Um... Dang it. That's a lot more rare than primordial oil, I believe. I know we need deep brine. Dang it. Well, I'm not worried about the lucky. Hexacomb, yeah, we made the right decision. We made the right decision. Nope, oh, give me that back. <laughs> give me that back. Alright, anything that I'm missing from here? I don't think so. So we should be able to go to the end here. Ooh, that was kind of close. That was kind of close. I didn't even realize that. Uh, I never see resources like I've been getting from the drills and stuff. Is this where the volcano is? No. I'd like to know where the volcano is at. Alright, this is the end part though. And I have another... Was this... More hexacombs, more buzzwax. Chickens and odd onions. <laughs> Alright, where was the, um, where's the teleporter? No. I thought the teleporter was around here. Yeah, it's off this side. Yeah. <laughs> I found it now. Beautiful. Okay, so we got some more things to deposit here. Can we build anything new? I know there's a bunch of stuff to form. I'm gonna have to wait. I'm gonna have to wait. So we finally have drills out. Okay, and what can we make with this now? So, warp tech. Pink teleporters, strange diamond, gray teleporters, strange diamond. Warp Depot, Lava Dust. I still haven't found any of these. We need some of the um, the bigger extractors. So let's see. Can we learn the bigger extractors here? We'll earn a little bit of money here. Advanced Drill. Advanced Pump. Advanced Apiary. I think that's what we need. Slime ball hoop, red warp depot, red teleporter, blue teleporter. The gray is, the pink and the gray is good enough right now. So we can make an advanced pump, which is booms, pinks. Oh man, pinks take, it takes 20 pinks for the advanced. Dang. We might need even more pinks than we already thought we did. Sheesh, man. Oh, I'm sorry about that, guys. Yep, well, <laughs> I can't believe. We're going to need a lot of pinks. I think I'm going to fill that other area up with pinks. That just seems like the logical choice here. So, I'll tell you what we're going to do. I'm not really worried about that right now. Let's go get some pinks and put them in that little area. All right, plenty of pinks out here now. Good. Let's grab. And we'll have to see how our other places do in two. We might as well just grab everything pink over here, including plorts, slimes, all of it. Can't believe we need that much. But we will. Oh, it got all over the uh the deal. No. 
Okay, we sh we really don't need any phosphors. Um, I don't think we need any carrots and stuff either. We're gonna need a little bit to feed them, but not a whole bunch. And this is gonna be all the tabby and stuff we ever need. Uh, there's no chickens around. I can't do anything with these guys. I wish you can bring home the lucky slimes. That would be cool. I might just wild ranch that area too. You think that's wise? I mean, like I said before, it's only pinks, so it's not a big deal. If we had just an overflow in that area and they wouldn't get out, we can possibly do some crazy stuff in there with pinks and tabbies. So I tell you what, I'm gonna do. <laughs> let's get let's get a little crazy, y'all. Let's get a little crazy. Oh no, the other area. That's right. And I'll grab. We don't want to do any pink hunters, I don't think. It'll just be pink tabbies back here. It'll be all right. Okay. None of them got out yet, which is good. Okay. Pink plorts. All the tabbies are done. Let's go with pink slimes. I'm not going to wild ranch them quite yet. Um, corral. Let's do one more. High walls. Air net. Plort collector. Oh, uh, yeah, I can't afford any more. Okay, well, this will just have to do. <laughs> and we're gonna have to fill this up with tabbies. If I wild ranch this area, I mean, it's gonna be really nice. There'll be stuff everywhere. The chickens and stuff, I don't even know how this is gonna work. <laughs> I really don't. We need to make sure these are fed so that they produce a few tabby plorts. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. If they produce a few tabby plorts, then they're going to turn into Largos, and we'll be pretty set up. There we go. And now we'll have a few more pink plorts for a little bit more drill action. And that's pretty good. So we filled up the overgrowth. <laughs> We're going to need a lot more where that came from, but it definitely is something to get. So the last stop is going to be the lab. And I'm going to grab all of these. Do we need to replant yet? No. Not yet. Plenty of carrots, odd onions. These aren't quite ready yet. Yeah, they'll be ready soon though. And now the pink plorts will have enough for maybe like one advanced drill or something? Or an advanced apiary or something? Okay, so we'll do an advanced drill, fabricate, and we'll put that like right here at this one, and we'll try to see what that gives us next episode. There we go, that's going to be an advanced one. So yeah, we'll, we'll experiment and see a little bit what, what happens with these, but I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, give me some dap on that like button to show you support, and you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Ulgen signing off, and we'll see you next time.